Hey guys, so I went shopping at the range and pets at home today and I picked up a few things for the pets. So the first things I picked up were from pets at home and these were two of the Woodlands small bulrush balls and this is just what they look like. So these were a pound each. So the next things I picked up from pets at home were two of the medium and toss dog chews. So these are perfectly safe for hamsters and what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut them up and split them between the hamsters and these were also a pound each. And then the last two things I picked up from Pets at Home were two of the Good Bite Tiny and Natural Cheese Chews by Furplast. So my hamsters love these chews and they are currently £2.50 instead of £3. So I'm going to cut one in half for the Syrians and cut one into quarters for the dwarfs. So from the range, the first two things that I picked up were two of these Lazy Bones wood chews. So these were 59p each and I've never seen these before and I thought they were super cute. So these are going to be for the Syrians. The next thing I picked up for the hamsters was a box of the Burgess XL Square Snacks for all small furry animals and these are carrot and banana flavour so I couldn't find these anywhere where I used to live and I saw them today and I just thought I had to get them because I've tried all the other new treats by Burgess but I've not tried these ones so these were one ninety nine for a 60 gram box I then picked up a packet of the Burgess XL Mountain Meadow Herbs for Fibervores so it says suitable for rabbits, guinea pigs and chinchillas but on the back it does actually say that it is suitable for other small furry animals and I've checked the ingredients and they're all perfectly safe for hamsters so these were one ninety nine for a 120 gram packet and I thought that was really good because you do get a lot in these and they look really really good and I'm trying to move the hamsters onto more natural treats rather than sugary treats because I do have three hamsters that are diabetic prone so I bought them this to try and I really hope they like it because of Burgess is a really good brand of treats and the last thing I picked up from the range was a packet of millet sprays so my hamsters love millet and they've not had it for ages so I went ahead and picked some of this up and the millet inside here looks really really good and you do get quite a lot in here so millet is probably my hamster's favourite treat but they don't get it too often so these were £1.50 for a 100 gram packet which I thought was really good and super cheap comparing to how much pets at home want to charge for them so yeah that is everything I picked up if you have any questions then please feel free to comment and as always I'll try to answer if you have any video requests then please let me know and I will add them to the list. So yeah, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe, bye!